continues tracking to the east, that means North Oaks and White Bear Lake, you're in the uh, path of this as well. This will pass quickly. It will not last long. This is not like last night's storms. It went on and on and on. This is a different kind of storm, but if you're up to the north in Circle Pines, Blaine, Lexington, you're probably getting hail right now. Same thing at southwestern corners of Lionel Lakes. Remember, the storm has had a history of producing a tornado already on the north side of Lake Minnetonka and then coming across the north side of the metro. We'd be pretty familiar with. Yeah, those are very busy uh, roads up in the northern Here's part of Ramsey Lexington County. Lexington here. Uh, probably right on top of 96 in Lexington right now, um, or awful close to it, the worst part of the um, rotating part of the storm. The, the good thing for the part that's rotating, if you happen to be under that, is it will pass you very quickly. It is not going to linger. Um, the people that are going to put up with flooding rains and large hail are going to be Hugo, Lionel Lakes, Circle Pines, and Lexington. Uh, those areas need to be concerned here with some street flooding. We're not getting any reports on that right now, but be alert to that. Uh, just north of this area, it is not uncommon at all. When you have a storm producing a tornado that just a mile or two north of there, you get baseball-sized hail, and sometimes you get two, three inches of rain mm -hmm. in a half an hour time. So that could be a possibility. It looks this like on top of the two to five inches of rain we saw right. the last day and a half. So yeah, the ground certainly can't handle it. So if you're in an area prone, maybe you have a stream running by, or you're in a low spot, uh, definitely you won't be able to handle the rain. Right, in those areas where it is raining.